are back. Okay. Now we're just gonna walk into here. Can I walk yet? No? Okay. See, I'm kind of nervous because on I can see what I'm recording, you know, as I'm recording it, and for some reason there's a very large delay behind what what I'm doing. Here, I'll show you. Um, okay, I have stopped moving. Now I'm gonna click once. It just moved. Okay, so in that time frame is how long it took. Move it, Lieutenant. Stop goofing around. The station's just ahead. Let's proceed, Lieutenant. The Great Gate Station. I misread it as the Great Great Station. Gates closed for maintenance. I see how it is. Well, it says go that way, so I'm not going to go that way. Someone in my unit reckons a lone soldier survived the tragedy of Highlands of Wood. But, but I can't believe anyone made it out of that alive. The battle just turned into the worst nightmare. Everyone was killed regardless of which side where they were on. Super Sprint! Inside the monorail car. You don't need to take... Why don't you take a break for a moment? Once we get to the station, we'll have to walk the rest of the way to the council hall. Hey, you're that guy, right? The soldier dot, that can't die. Dot. 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 The 17th Division. That was the front line. They were smack in the middle of the Wool Highlands. No one could have survived that meteor crash. But here you are, without a scratch. Beg your pardon, Lieutenant. It's really strange. The few we were able to save were far from the center of impact. And even those men were seriously injured. It's just... It's hard to believe that anyone could have survived that inferno. Then don't believe it. Uh oh. The council won't like that attitude. Come on, tell us. How'd you make it? Sorcery! Oh, look at that death glare. More problems with monster attacks than even more troubles caused by magic energy. Thank you. There's a mass panic at the capital and fear that it will be the next target of the next meteor. Some people have already started to flee. They say people from both sides were wiped out together on the highlands of wool. What the hell is up? You've heard about the meteor that fell on the highland of wool. Yeah, I fucking, of course. Everyone died, it seems. It's terrible. Okay, everyone's talking about it. <laughs> also about the town. The magic industrial revolution to protect us from these things like this. Oh, 
Oh yeah. Is it true the Kents have requested a truce? Indeed. We heard that enough men were committed to cover the Wall Highlands and that most of the Kent force were eliminated. This war was started by them. It's only right they withdraw. We've also lost a tremendous number of troops. After suffering such a devastating loss, if the Gotsa were to strike now, there would be no way we could defend our country. And there are also whispers that Gotza was pulling strings behind the invasion. What makes you think that the Gotza were involved? We have confirmed that a large amount of military hardware has been moved from Gotza to Kent. We assume Gotza plans to use Kent to keep things stirred up and destabilize Ura. Are you saying that even the meteor crash was a Gotzen plot? My lord, I have some disturbing information on that subject. We suspect that a situation at Grandstaff may have caused the meteor crash. Grandstaff? This is not the first time that stories about it have reached my ears. This is not confirmed, but magic energy may have leaked out of Grandstaff, interfered with something in outer space, and precipitated this disaster. Gongora! Yes, my lord. The Grandstaff falls under your jurisdiction. Do you have anything to say? Nothing for the moment. Where did you get this information? Construction of Grand Staff is going smoothly. Now that the forces of Ura have suffered such devastating losses, I think we have no other way to protect our land except with the magic energy that Grand Staff will provide. 
We should hold off on debating the pros and cons of Grand Staff until we've thoroughly reviewed the world's current situation. What you say makes sense, but our plan to use magic energy is a double-edged sword. With all sorts of rumors flying around, we might want to halt construction of Grand Staff. What? Only temporarily. As soon as it's clear that Grand Staff had nothing to do with the meteor collision, we'll resume construction immediately, Gungora. I think I might be shutting this off here in a second. I don't know. Oh, that is nothing. Huh. Oh, something shiny. I'll look at that on my own time. Okay, bitch. Fellas, I'm going to be shutting this off in a second. We don't have much time to waste here. Once we're out in the station, please follow me straight to the council. We must get moving. Lieutenant Argarar is quite a long way to the council hall. And with that, I bid you farewell.